in a quiet part of the Berkshire Downs, there is an ancient church. Should you wish to wander around the graveyard, and if you pay close attention, you might come across a grave with a queen bee carved into the stone. This is the resting place of William Woodley. During his lifetime, William Woodley was a household name in the world of beekeeping. He was an avid correspondent to beekeeping journals over the course of 40 plus years. He built a bee farm, which at one point was the largest bee farm in Britain, and sold honey to all parts of Britain and its empire. He was a champion at the show bench, winning many top prizes, and was even presented to Queen Victoria. William Woodley's legacy is his large volume of writing, which is found in various beekeeping journals. He has left us with a valuable time capsule of life on the Berkshire Downs during the last quarter of the 19th century and the first two decades of the 20th century. William Woodley's writings chronicle a number of historical transitions. In beekeeping, the move from the skep to the movable frame hive and the rise of bee diseases. On the Berkshire Downs, it was the move to the towns and cities by the agricultural labourers because of mechanisation in farming and competition from the new world. He describes a shrinking world due to the advances in communications, transport and trade. Yet with sadness describes the disappearance of a way of life on the Berkshire Downs. This video is an introduction to the world of William Woodley. I plan to make a series of videos about various topics related to William Woodley and his life on the Berkshire Downs. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then press the like button. I will have more videos out in the near future, so please subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments, then please let me know in the section below. Bye for now.